Alrighty, Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for the Promised Neverland Chapter 99. So, last week, um, or two weeks ago, I'm sorry, uh, because last week we had no fucking chapters, um, but two weeks ago, um, we got this mysterious call, and I still think it is William Minerva. I... Honestly, do I think it's William Minerva hands fucking down? Anyway, um, let's get to chapter ninety nine and see what happens. Holy crap! I can't believe we're almost at a hundred chapters. I've been covering this manga since chapter three. Holy shit! I just realized that. A message from um, those inheriting Minerva's will, a guiding light. Our supporters do exist. Yes, they do. It wasn't a recording. That was live through the receiver. Was that an ally? Was that the real thing? Yeah. An enemy would try to find our location or, or lure, us out, uh, lure us out of hiding. My guess is he'll call again. However, I'm still doubtful. Um, the possibility of it being an enemy still exists. I think it's real. I'm glad. With this, we've successfully contacted our allies. And the fact that Ray says it's real, I, I, that means I, I, I believe it's real. I'm, I'm going with Ray's. Gut instinct, especially um, since uh, what the uh, the guy said. Oh, sorry. Oh my God. Especially what the guy said at the end of the uh, chapter. Someone willing to help us? No, we don't know that yet. Ah, oh, I think the supporters will have to will want to have us all flee in secret. They don't know we uh, plan on fighting the seven walls and saving all the kids uh, being eaten. Search for the seven walls. Um, Minerva might have expected that uh, someone would pick this option, but we'll have to let them know somehow. They're definitely on our side. Even so, I was starting to feel pretty desperate. The conversation was extremely short, and they said they'd call, back, call within 24 hours, but it took them one week. And also, the, I, can't re I can't meet right now. My guess is that they are close to the enemy. Oh, God! I still want to be Peter! Peter. I, I know it's not Peter. Um. Well, we can't know that for sure. I will contact you directly. I will definitely come to see you. That's what our allies told us. We need to prepare for the moment uh, this ally contacts us. Let's have people uh, alternate bringing, uh, being in charge of the phone. Maybe it would be good to teach everyone Morse code. Yeah. After that, until contact happens, I want to proceed somehow. Towards finding the seven walls. Uh, here we go. The huge uh, family's bustling life at the shelter. And this chapter is how... Oh my god, I'm probably going to butcher the fuck out of this pronunciation. Holy shit. Oh. Mm. Um, and this chapter is titled uh, Kavidala. There we go. Oh my god, I did not butcher it. With the eye of Kavidala uh, dragon, um, search for the day and night. First 10 kilometers north, and then 10 kilometers towards the east after that. Head to 10 kilometers south, then 10 kilometers towards the west, then 10 uh, to the sky, uh, 10 kilometers to the sky, and 10 kilometers towards the underground. When the arrow between the sand ceases and the sun sets in the east, the earth will cry, um, and the wall will appear. That has the division between him, us, and him and us, the seven walls. That's super obscure. Yeah, no matter how you look it, um, this is totally un unintelligible. For example, telling us to go north and south. If they're all the same distance, we'll, end, we'll just end up at square one. But I've seen this cubby doll before. So have I. Are these the descriptions? Are are these the decryptions I asked for? Decryptions? This really was a book of the archives. When it comes to books about the promise and demons, it's the oldest one in the archives. It's in tatters, but this could be useful. Just how old is this book? That's not all I have to. Uh, that's not. Uh, ugh. That's not all. I have a favor to ask. I deciphered it because Ray asked me to. Well, I would think so. Um, but God, that those directions though from for the dragon are just so fucking weird. It's not just that uh, the language is old. This is written with a unique handwriting on rag-like paper. Do you even know what language it is? It's mirrored Latin. Latin? Handwriting? 
Uh, Latin was a language common in the ancient Roman Empire. Mirrored writing is when you write letters of reverse. Oh, I noticed that. Rome? I noticed the Latin dictionary sitting on the other shelf, but I don't have time before... I'm sorry, but I didn't have time before going to Goldie Pond, um, so I asked these guys to decipher it. And when I read it, it was um, as Ray suspected. This book is the copy of a manuscript written by a couple of people. They were from different places. The Latin part seemed to be the oldest of all. Then maybe that clan who made the promise, maybe it was a handwritten account from a hundred years ago. After finding words and um, making them more readable, I made a guess. I'm not sure about the exact contents, but that's where it came from. Uh, Kavidala. Kavidala. Is it a place? Otherwise, the most likely is I brought a map right here. Those are uh, the new coordinates. Are these the same coordinates as the pen? With the eye of Kavidala Dragon, search for the day and night. There aren't any other hints. Yeah, first we'll have to go to Kavidala. D528-143. That's that's where we're got that's that's our next adventure. That's so far from here. Who's going? Our allies told us to stay in BO6-3032. For the most part, I want us to stay as well. Let's only take a few of us. Bring too many people will get us noticed. An elite force. Emma, Ray, and Hugo. First me and Emma. And then Don and G Wait, what? The Don and Gilda! Huh? Hey, are the small kids going to be okay with that? There are going to be a lot of demons, of course. And you don't, won't have um, any kind of guide in this situation. We're headed into unknown territory here. I know that it's dangerous, and if you came along, we would be much stronger. When our ally contacted us, I understood. The enemy is definitely searching for us. They're definitely looking for this shelter. I don't want us um, to be—I don't want us to be spread thin. This is the ba um, this is the base of the cow children where uh, we all live. Hugo, I want to ask you to keep the shelter hidden and protect everyone. No! I want Hugo to go. Hugo's just like you dumbasses. Uh, that's how you go looking at them right now. You was like, are you fucking serious right now? Really? You want to go out there blind? Jesus freaking Christ. The stupidity right now. I'm sorry. This is fucking retarded. And besides, we have a reliable younger sibling, Don and Gilda. Um, right. I remember uh, you showed us that during um, the prison break. Look at their crying, but... Well, if you don't want to, like hell I wouldn't want to! Hooray! We're happy! Because I thought I was just a caretaker, having to just wait around was so painful. I'm so happy I can stand alongside you. No! I don't like this! No! At least have you go come with us! But, okay, the other thing I, I can see is... That Hugo is just going to be chilling here and, you know, catching up on old times. That's what I think. It's the other option. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I am really, really fucking tired. And it's hard when I don't have my meds. Oh, I hate that I can't afford them. I am that fucking broke right now. It is that bad. But I'm still powering through this. Um, sorry to be a wet blanket, but if possible, you should bring these two along. They should be okay. They should be okay. It's hard to keep watch with less than four people. With these two, you could split it. Hugo's worried, I see. <laughs> Busted. Would you be all right coming along? With pleasure. Uh, um, they should be okay if Zach and Violet tag along. Was he always so overprotective? <laughs>
wants to um wants to stick with the uh, um or, or go back to the original formula, I guess, with the kids. But I don't know. I'm just I'm just really torn about this shit right now. Like I I understand why we're going with the kids, but still, I'm what are you gonna go? This is such bullshit. <sighs> the only other thing I can think of is that they want you to stay to train the kids, you know, to prepare them for um, the attack, because we know that's gonna happen. We know it. Holy shit. I'm sorry. I am goddamn tired. I did not get enough sleep. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys thought of this chapter. And remember, to, um, and do you guys think, do you guys think it was a mistake that you go ain't gone with us? Like I do. I think it's a huge fucking mistake. And what do you think about those directions? And what do you think this fucking dragon is? Like, uh, the, what do you think the cubby dog is? I'm just, like, is, do you guys think that's, that is the seven walls? I, no, I have no goddamn clue. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below or the Nerdy Kids Inc. Discord server. The link to that's in the description box below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy Kids Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to my channel expansion, there's a few ways you could do that. You can donate to my PayPal, Patreon, go fund me, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, friend me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.